An LLC is a company or business structure owned by one or more individuals or entities. LLCs do not pay taxes per se, instead, the LLC tax structure treats profits like pass-through income. In other words, net losses or profits are passed through to each LLC member and taxed as part of their individual federal tax return. One major issue when buying property as an LLC is a bank. Banks usually don't feel comfortable loaning large sums of money to a new LLC. They fear the legal ramifications should the LLC owner face an issue and be unable to pay back the loan. An easy solution to this problem is to get a home mortgage in your name. Once you get the mortgage, then you can transfer the property to the LLC. The home loan will remain in your name. This keeps banks from having to deal with unsecured money and, at the same time, it protects the property. The primary question that arises from buying a house under an LLC is why do people do it? There are some key advantages of buying property as an LLC. 1. Maintains privacy. If privacy is your concern, then LLC is your best option since the owner listed in public records will be the company's name and not the owner's. Members of the LLC are usually not listed in these documents, which keeps people out of situations where property ownership could be damaging or embarrassing. It ultimately enhances the owner's privacy. 2. Legal protection. In addition to privacy, LLCs provide some level of protection in the event of a lawsuit. If you own rental property, you probably never think about your tenants or their guests falling victim to injury or, even worse, death while on your property. But, if it happens, legal damages would be assessed against the owner's property and not the owner's personal assets. 3. Pass-through taxation with LLCs. Some people even consider it the primary reason for starting an LLC to buy real estate. It simply means that the company avoids the double taxation typically they are subjected to pay. What happens is that the Internal Revenue Service, IRS, considers LLCs as partnerships or sole proprietorships. It depends on how many members the business has. The loss and profit of the business are passed through to its owner. Owners pass through entities have to pay only personal taxes on the income of the company. In contrast, the company itself doesn't have to pay and therefore has no responsibility for taxes. Multi-member LLCs can also take advantage of pass-through taxation. One additional requirement is that every member has to file Form 1065 or K form when they file their income taxes. It identifies the shares of losses or profit they got from an LLC as still LLC itself is not responsible for taxation. So far, you might have been seeing the brighter side of buying property as an LLC, there are also some drawbacks. 1. Financing can be difficult. Getting finance is often the primary requirement of many prospective homeowners, and they also seek programs like FHA loans. FHA loans require a smaller down payment on a property. That's why most people try to acquire them. The major drawback of buying an LLC is that these loans are offered to individuals and not companies. 2. Cannot take benefit of tax breaks. Individuals can also enjoy lower interest rates. Prospective owners may also enjoy tax breaks on their primary residence mortgage. An added benefit is that you can deduct the mortgage from your income. So, if an LLC owns the property, individuals cannot enjoy those tax breaks. 3. Personal liability doesn't go away. Another drawback is that it becomes hard to separate business from personal affairs when purchasing a home under an LLC. Although you might choose to maintain your personal and investment spheres separately using different email addresses, bank accounts, and credit cards, it is still tempting to leverage the benefits that come with owning a home as an LLC. So you must be disciplined and draw a clear line between the personal and the LLC. And, of course, some co-op boards in apartment complexes appreciate the idea of individual ownership rather than ownership by an LLC. So you might experience some pushback when you go to purchase a co-op through an LLC. How are LLCs used in real estate? In real estate, investors use LLCs as a tool to buy and hold real estate investment properties. Different investors use different types of LLCs as well as for different purposes and motivations. Some may use them for legal or financial protection, tax minimization, or flexible membership. It depends on your situation if these benefits are relevant to you or not. 